Hi, Sophie King Drunk here with uh, yet another attempt at a cider review. Cider I'm going to review uh, just now is uh, it's one that I've drank the lager years and years ago. Uh, used to quite enjoy the lager, but now I'm going to step in and see what the Stella Artois Cidre, as a guy in the telly tells us, not cider, Cidre, 4.5 in a Richter scale, hand picked apples. Apparently, it's the only boast it's got on the bottle. So I'll get this uh, bad boy open and see what it comes up with. Whoa! A lot of life in that. That can I'll just show you that. The carbonation going up the glass, uh, the, the, the bottle now, as soon as I lifted the cap off it. Pretty nice. Well, it's all still at Artois. I've got the Stella Artois small chalice, the lager chalice, right enough, not the Cidre chalice. There we go, there's a pour. There we go, have a little smell. Amazing how I get nothing on the nose for beers, but get it in the cider. There's apples and that. <laughs> well, anyway, so freaking drunk. It's all about the taste. I'll have a go now at the Cidra by Stella Artois. 4.5 Narector scale. Slangeva. Well, <clears throat> I've just actually reviewed another cider in front of that and uh, I was expecting something on par with it. That to me is just chemicals. That is just chemicals. That'll, that'll have its market. It's got a very perfumey taste to it. Uh, you can tell there's all sorts of sweeteners and artificial crap in that. Uh, doesn't tell you what it's actually, it just says hand picked apples. Uh, wait a minute, let's have a go here and see what it says in the small print. Yes, uh, crisp and refreshing Belgian cider made with hand picked apples, and then in brackets beside it, it's got 50%. I don't know if you can see that or not. Uh, believe me, it says 50%. Contains, ah, here we go, contains. Sulfites for freshness. Well, there you go. Sulfites, that doesn't sound very, very nice. Uh, rather disappointed with that, to tell you the truth. It said mass cam uh, marketing campaigning, TV, you name it, magazines. It's out there. Uh, but believe me, it will have its market. People will just drink it because it's got still an artwork on it. Uh, I'm actually quite disappointed with that, to tell you the truth. Uh, it's, it's just, uh, to me, it's just chemicals in a glass. Right, anyway, I'll go in here for another little sip and then I'll give you a sofa can drunk rating. Yeah, it's just, to be honest with you, it's just bland. It's got sort of perfume made blandness about it is it's one of those ones it's, it's, it's stuck to your your gums to go and brush your teeth after drinking this it's attacking your whatever's in it it's just totally attacking your your teeth anyway I'm going to give uh, the old Cidra by Stella Artois 4.5 director scale I'm going to give that a Sophie King drunk rating of uh, 2 out of 5 for me it has got its market, but as I would say, its market is uh, the people just see Stella Artois and the mass advertising, the brainwashed by it. It would be me, uh, I would say try something else, have a go at something else, have a go at it if you, you want to try it, Have a, by all means have a go at it, but uh, th there will be better ciders out there. So anyway, I'm so freaking drunk with yet another attempt at a cider review, so anyway. 
Take it easy, Sanji Van, and I'll maybe see you for another one. Bye now.